millions of combinations, and much more. One Word English. Hi, you're watching One Word English. Can one simple word make your English better? Of course, if you know how to use it. Today we're going to learn about the word stick. Uh, the basic meaning of this word is to stick a pointed object into or through something. For example, to stick a fork into a sausage. Uh, but this word has some other meanings as well. Listen to a little story. Tony was helping his dad fixing the car when his friend's head stuck out of the window. His friend shouted, Hey, Tony, what's up? Do you want to come and stick around for lunch? I'd love to, said Tony, but I'm stuck with fixing my dad's car. There isn't a possum stuck in the engine. Okay, now let's see what the word stick means in these sentences. The first phrase, his friend's head stuck out of the window, means his friend's head came out beyond the window and became visible. Next phrase, do you want to come and stick around for lunch? means, do you want to come and stay at my place for lunch? Tony's answer, I'm stuck with fixing my dad's car, means, I have to stay and continue fixing my dad's car. And finally, there isn't a possum stuck in the engine, means, there isn't a possum that is caught and can't get out of the engine. Now, look at these pictures again and answer my questions quickly. What did Tony see when he was helping his dad fixing his car? Right, he saw his friend's head stuck out of the window. What did his friend suggest him to do? He invited Tony to come and stick around for lunch. Why couldn't Tony go to his friend's place? Because he was stuck with fixing his dad's car. What happened to the car engine? There was an opossum stuck in it. You can use the word stick in all similar situations. Sticking out your tongue is impolite if you're not a monkey, of course. The boy sticks with doing his homework. Look at that, his finger is stuck in the cup. Anytime you see a similar situation around you, just say a phrase with the word stick and you'll learn it very quickly. You've been watching One Word English. See you soon.